you know, there's just been an explosion of alternative proteins on the market, alternative meat. You look at uh, the way that meat's made today, you look at a cow, it takes two years to make a cow, that's insane. We have to figure out a new way to do this, or, you know, specifically to get to a steak, it takes two years to make a steak. Uh, and it takes a lot of water, a lot of land, 2019 saw record uh, fires in the Amazon just to make room for cattle grazing, and so we need alternatives. And so we're, uh, you know, in, in, you know, commercializing the most sustainable way to make protein on the planet. If you look at the carbon footprint, it's, it's carbon negative. You look at the water utilization. If you compare it to soy, it's going to take a soy farm the size of Texas to give you the same amount of protein as you get from an air protein farm the size of Walt Disney World. So significant land reduction, significant water reduction, and then with this new innovative way of making a protein, we apply culinary techniques and we end up with air-based meat.